Now, seven weather with meteorologist Erica Delgado. The temperatures are warming quickly. We're already in the mid 80s from West Kendall into 83 degrees in Fort Lauderdale and Miami. 82 degrees right now in Key West. The wind is out of the east southeast. It's between 10 to 15 miles per hour and we're expecting breezy conditions at times and you can see storm tracker has been quiet across Miami Dade and Broward County. High pressure in control of the weather pattern, but through the foreseeable future, we'll begin to see it breaking down, turning uh, lighter winds for the upcoming weekend. That means temperatures will be back into the lower 90s, some spots into the mid 90s. And then as we head into next week, that's when we'll see slightly better rain chances across South Florida. Marine forecast Miami Dade and Broward near shore waters. Rip current still a problem up and down our beaches with winds up to 15 knots, seas two to three feet. And then the small craft advisory across the Keys has been canceled. There's now a used caution until wind speeds begin to subside a bit. Seas beyond the reef about four to six feet. But for your Wednesday, an isolated shower too possible, otherwise mainly dry conditions, near average temperatures, but feeling like the mid 90s once you factor in the humidity. Overall, a nice day for us here in South Florida and tonight looking calm and quiet. Temperatures overnight hovering around that 80 degree mark. It will be feeling warm and you'll really notice the difference as we head into the second half of the work week. For one, temperatures will be warmer, reaching into lower 90s, but two, wind speeds just won't be as strong and then we'll have a little more in the way of humidity, especially as we head into the upcoming weekend. Temperatures will be reaching into lower 90s. Feels like temperatures possibly reaching into the upper 90s through the weekend with a few isolated showers. And then as we head into next week, that's when we'll see not only steamy conditions, but we will see slightly uh, better rain and, uh, and storm chances with an uptick in moisture moving across South Florida. That's your 7 on 7.